please don't make it your last please click on the subscribe button like and share this video so i'm your baby girl Oge. i talk about business beauty and personal development from Asaba delta state if this interests you please consider subscribing thank you so today we are going to talk about things you need to know before starting a hair business maybe most of you are considering going into hair business but there are certain things you need to know before you go into hair business so the number one thing you need to know before you go into hair business is everybody is not your customer yes before you go into hair business you need to know who your target customers are who are you selling to is it to students is it to working class ladies is it as in who are you actually selling to so by that you will know the kind of hair that you actually sell so the number so the number two thing you need to know when going into hair business is know how to style and know the types of hair available you need to know how to style hair because styling is the beauty of hair you can't just wig your hair like that without styling the hair makes no sense so when you style your hair that's it brings out the beauty in the hair so when considering going into hair business you need to know how to style and you need to know the types of hair available like what type of hair do you want to sell is it virgin hair is it remy hair is it and what country do you need to get your hair from is it vietnam or china these are things you need to know before going into hair business another thing you need to know when going into hair business is how to market of course you're not the person that is going to use all your products so before you consider purchasing those hair you need to know how to market them you need to know when going into hair business is don't start with borrowed money yes it's better to start with drop shipping get the pictures of the hair that you want to sell market them sell take your own gain and give to the your supplier that is the best way to start or don't start with borrowed money because at the end of the day you might end up not being able to pay that loan no i'm not trying to be negative here but don't start hair business with borrowed money. Thank you. Another thing you need to know is to choose quantity over quantity. Yes, because quantity that is fake hair we end up spoiling in your hands when you don't sell them. But quality will last longer in your hands. Even if you don't sell them at the particular time that you ordered for them, you are still going to sell them because they won't get spoiled. So choose quality over quantity so another tip you need to know before going into hair business is know how to manage your money maybe you've sold a couple of hairs you've made some money you feel like you are balling you want to spend money no that is not how to go about it when starting off in a hair business you need to know how to manage your money you need to know the one that is capital out of every sale that you make you need to know the one that is cost price know the one that is your profit in it so that you know how to spend so that you don't end up spending your capital another tip you need to know when going into hair business is do not sell on credit no matter who is buying don't sell on credit if you start selling your hair on credit it is going to spoil your business so don't sell on credit it's cash or nothing you need to know when starting hair business the last but not the least when going into hair business is to use your products you can't be selling vietnam hair and you are always on sponge that's not how it goes now so know how to use your products using your products will encourage your buyers this they will see it on your hair and they'll be like oh i love this hair you say i sell so and if you are selling rubber hairs Consider using rubber heads because you cannot be selling rubber heads and you're always on bone straight. How will your buyers feel to buy? As in, they won't be encouraged to buy those ones. So, always use your product. It is the number one selling tips for you when you are going into hair business. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe, share this video. Thank you. I'm still your baby girl, Odu.